My all-time uh, favorite film is uh, Tokyo Monogatari, uh, Tokyo Story in English, from the amazing Japanese director Yasujiro Ozu. You know, came out in 1953. Um, it's in black and white, right? For me, Tokyo Story really represents peak Ozu. You know, he's at the height of his career. He had just burst onto the scene after releasing his previous film, uh, Early Summer, first film in the uh, Noriko trilogy. And, you know, Ozu has had so many amazing films. Uh, but I think with Tokyo Story, he really tapped into something special. So so, so the film is about uh, an elderly couple and, and their children um, and, uh, and about change. The younger generation coming in and uh, the older generation um, kind of being kind of being rendered obsolete. It's this quiet kind of smoldering slow building masterpiece. What I really love about the film is the pathos. Don't get me started on the pathos. You will be here with me talking all day. So I first saw the film when I think I was seven years old. My mother took me to a little uh, indie film house. Actually, it used to be right here uh, down, down on Melrose uh, in Los Angeles. You know, I was raised by a single mother and she had to work, you know, two jobs. And so during the summers when I'd have all this free time, you know, she'd, she'd give me a nickel or whatever and, and send me down to the, uh, the film house there. And, you know, instantly loved the film Tokyo Story. Totally related to it. Of course, uh, Ozu wrote the film with his uh, lifelong uh, writing partner, Kobo Noda, right? You know, who's an, a, an amazing uh, writer in his own right. I think the two went on to collaborate on something like 20 pictures together. Just, just crazy, you know, to think about that now, that just the, the scope of what they were producing, right? So obviously an amazing cast, right? Just powerhouses of Japanese cinema. Uh, so Chishu Ryu uh, plays the husband uh, in, in, I think, his best role. I know I know you might disagree. We talked a little bit about this earlier uh, off, off camera. And I do, you know, think he is fantastic in Gokumonchu. I think, it, I think it's, it's very close, but I, I would give the edge to his performance in Tokyo Story. Jiako Higashiyama uh, plays the wife. Really, at the time, she was regarded as not only the best actress in Japan, but really uh, the world. And then, and then, of course, you know, you have the, the children, uh, the daughters, played by, you know, Setsuko Hara, Hiyashi Sugimura. Brilliant performances, brilliant artists, you know, Oscar-worthy performances in their own right, you know, based certainly based on today's standards, right? Cinematography, uh, really at the time, there was nothing that rivaled uh, Tokyo Story. The director of photography was uh, Yuharu Atsuta, just a you know pioneer, total tastemaker. He was inspired by you know the great European cinematographers, Vittoria De Sica, uh, Mikel uh, Luca. I do believe it's it, it is his greatest work. Oh, oh, completely. Oh, thank you for having me. Yeah. So just right here. Thanks YouTube for watching. Please come see my uh, new film Poo Poo Pee Pee. It's out uh, April 1st. Uh, it's a comedy. I'm really proud of it. I think it's a lot of fun. Uh, you'll enjoy it. So uh, uh, please come see it.